I'm back in cartoon form. I want to talk a little bit about Martin DM. Where is he? Where? Some people would have you believe that maybe he's in prison. Or maybe he left this platform because he was scared that he was going to get exposed. You know, someone's going to do a video exposing him. Which I have to say, if anybody was going to expose this guy, don't you think they would have done it already? If there was any information about him that we didn't know. Do you know don't you think that AD would have already put it out there a million times over? So, let me clue y'all in, y'all little conspiracy theorists out there. Martin is taking a break. Martin is tired because in case you haven't noticed, every now and then this community can get a little toxic and it can get filled with a lot of drama, a lot of unnecessary drama I might add, and he just needs a break. Mm. There's something wrong with your story, but I can't put my finger on it. So, for all you people out there just all gleeful, thinking something nefarious is going on, sorry to disappoint, he's just on a break. Although, Martin, you are always so dramatic when you take a break, because you always delete everything. <laughs> or you privatize everything, I'm not sure which, but... Uh, I think you do it on purpose, though, because you know people are going to talk, don't you? You're very clever that way. You sure about that? You sure about that? And I want to say for the people who have went after AD over the years and tried to correct his false narrative, who have debunked him, thank you. You know, going all the way back to Education Nation, Martin, Lexi, Martin pointed out the hypocrisy that is this guy, right? Because Scammy will get on his platform and say, I have never done anything wrong in my whole life. I do not deserve all this abuse and hate. These stupid trolls. I'm just a victim here. I'm the innocent victim. But Martin points out that, you know, he's doxxed people. He doxxed Martin. He's told lies about Martin, saying he has a criminal record when he doesn't. Accused Martin of being a woman. In the days of Education Nation, Bam and Martin. I was watching Mr. Martin D. Ham's latest video, and let me tell you, honey, I love me some Martin D. Ham. He never addresses his trolls. He ignores them. Quote trolls, by the way. Here's the thing. Yes, you do. How many times have you talked about Martin? Remember doxing Martin? Remember accusing him of being a criminal, which he is not? I love me some Martin Dehan. Now listen, Helen is a very strong woman. And she's got a very sunny disposition. And she also has Martin in her corner. My channel's not monetized. Fact check me. Martin is not monetized. So please, I would like you to tell me who of the truth channels is making money helen's not monetized lies let this thing go this fixation that you have with helen because let's be honest a lot of this has to do with helen for whatever reason, I don't know if it's because it's 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 because of Martin and people are just trying to get at him through her, or because there's some kind of jealousy going on. <laughs> <laughs> However, he also took this opportunity to bash Martin. And, and what has Martin done? We don't need to be putting out or alluding to something that may or may not be true, okay? Stick to the facts. And I say, I've said this so many times with all the creators on this platform. If you have the facts on your side, you don't need to do stuff like this. It's always been about his ego and making money and views and subscribers. But let's just excuse all that because we hate Martin. Um, he's being gang stalked, right? All, Grumpy Granny, Val, Martin, Helen, I don't know who else he named. You know, they were all in on it with Scott. Do you got, recall him doxing Martin? Okay. And I know people now, well, we hate Martin. So, as, but at some, at one point, everybody liked Martin. Everybody respected him. And now, now certain people don't, right? And Martin's the devil. The only one who I will now not say anything negative about is uh, Martin Dean. Martin will fill you in. 
if you want to ask Martin, he'll fill you in. I'm not going to talk behind the scenes about what people tell me behind the scenes. I'm not going to reveal sources or anything like that. Martin can fill you in. I can prove it with metadata. But do you know what? This is as much as I even ever need to talk about you again. Bye-bye genetic code in the bin. Just want you all to know in my chat, do not even... like You've got the Bim Bim, the Tintin, the Cassius, the genetic code. Now you've got Lizzie. Now you've got Lizzie's mods. Now, they're all fucking nutters. I'm nothing to do with any of those fucking nutters. Please stop putting me in the same box as those nutters. For me, you're somewhere between a cockroach and that white stuff that accumulates at the corner of your mouth when you're really thirsty. I love me some Martin Dehan. The only one who I will now not say anything negative about is uh, Martin Dehan. I love me some Martin Dehan. if you like someone but i also understand if someone is doing something wrong calling them out for it practice what you preach but here's the thing this is why we don't put our faith in youtubers right um and we see it so many times these youtubers that have this cult-like following right and it doesn't matter what they say people will stand behind them and rally for them even if they're wrong Practice what you preach. We don't need to be putting out or alluding to something that may or may not be true, okay? Stick to the facts. Martin, he needs to take a step back and he needs to regroup. 